Good night. All right, we got at least a duo queue on our team since they have the same little clan tag thing or whatever you call that. I'm gonna go for theme park here instead of Outback actually, because I don't want to play. Um, well, my team's gonna ban bank anyways. Theme park's just really tough to attack solo queue. They banned it anyways. We got Outback, of course. I mean, hey, just another opportunity to get better on the Outback, so it's all good. All right. I don't know about the Thatcher ban on Outback, but not terrible. As long as they ban Jackal here, not Doke or something, because I do like playing Doke. She's probably my main, I'd say. Okay, they banned no op since they're on attack first. We did kind of get blessed with defense first. That's like a huge thing in today's game. Like, I'm sure the percentages for whoever starts on defense is way higher than whoever starts on the attack. And then even more important, whoever gets OT first on defense probably wins a lot more. I would like to see like the percentages, but I'm not sure if that's a thing they keep track of. Also, as I'm rambling, we ban Cade, they ban Fenrir. Interesting ban phase overall. So Mira's up, Jackal, Dokubi, Ying. Solus and Azami, of course. What do I want to play here? I am a 1.5 crutch on this map. But I'm not sure. Let's try Mozzie first round, why not? I think last time when I played this, I was playing like Thorn and Warden. In my last Outback video. So let's change it up here with some Mozzie. We've got a Rook. Thunderbird, okay. Got the double healers. And they're both not Doc. I'm going to get a pest right here on the drone hole early because that's probably going to catch one. And if not, it's going to stop them from droning into that later in the round, which is huge. Because that is a popular drone hole. Usually teams attack from this side where I'm at right now. Then I'll like pest up the stairway right here. I think that's a good one. Stairways are usually uh, good hot spots for drones. And then this door to that side. Of course, the warden's just AFK in the prep phase, typical. It's a drone somewhere around side, but I don't know where it is. I didn't even know there's a drone hole there, to be honest. Rook is spawn peeking. Let's see how that goes. I was trying to get on cams for him, but nothing there. Can I even say I'm surprised at what just happened there? I am not. I'm not mad though, I'm just disappointed. Let's try to hide in the corner. Alright, they got the drone and the yawn on me there. Go ahead and scram from that spot. I think they're executing right now. I'm going to try to come back to site through the other stairway. Because I know they're holding me there. They got the yawn up still. I wasted some of their time and shot the clone and drone, so I did my part. One down here. Definitely below me. Good night. Let's try to see four. I was trying to go off sound there. I didn't really hear too much, though. I don't have any mozzie drones. I'm going to try to work back to site now. Oh, I missed by like a millimeter in the first shot. 
I knew the angle and everything. Good shot. He just got there too, unfortunately. I was hoping my teammate could stay alive a little longer, but he was feeling the pressure, so that's on me too. I should have just chilled on the other staircase instead of rotating. Because the C4 odds I had there were probably pretty low. I love how the Rook took the Mozzie too, of course. That guy steals Vomp. What else can we play here? Okay, Warren's taken. Let me get in the Ella. I feel like traps would help a lot here. We have a Thorn. That's who I played last time when I did this map, but I feel like Ella would be good too. Just put traps everywhere. Maybe that's the meta for Outback. I'm still trying to learn because, again, I haven't played this map that much, really. Compared to all the others, I have, like, no time on this one. I probably played the old version more than the reworked version because that's before I took a big break from Siege. Warp that up. Uh, drone. Um, I don't like this being here because I feel like that just gives them free entry. They don't have to worry about their back. Because I know every time I push there, it's hard to push because you got to worry about both sides. Got to make sure like both sides are clear. You put one on the hop in, and then I'll put one on the other hop in. That's gonna blow up for the cap cam, but all good. Maybe it'll go off first. I don't know. Again, just putting the traps everywhere here. Imagine. Yeah, I'm just gonna play the staircase. Maybe this is the play. I don't know if a teammate's actually in there, so I don't trust it fully. I guess I can just chill lower and they'll be fine right here. Next time I'll have to like, bring an alamine and throw it on the vending machine or something. Or like bottom stairs, I don't know. So I can play off that. Playing off utility is huge on defense. Especially when you're solo queue. You can use those as like extra teammates, basically. My LMI's and Barb. Okay, let me concentrate here. Breach is open. We got numbers. If I get fried off this, then good night to me. Of course, they drone it. That actually is a person. Wow. Okay, bandit killed her. I thought I was looking at something. I thought it was good since bandit was over there. Last one's gonna be baiting outside. Not on him though, his team just all died around him. That guy was like crouch walking in that room with Bandit right next to her. I think that was Twitch. Alright. Let's chill guys, let's chill. This is how you lose 1v3s, you start running at them. I'll try to play off her here so she doesn't die to the breach. He's just still out there shooting. Dude, Ace, like, you got your kill, you gotta actually try there. You have 30 seconds and there's only two of us. Why are you still on the window? Nobody else is, why not? I'm immune to stuns this way. And the Ying is up. I'm pretty sure if you shoot these, you can jump on the... Okay, well... I might have destroyed that, so never mind. You can actually jump on that, though. reinforce these. I don't even know if this is a good strat to reinforce these. I haven't played the site too much. Usually we go the other upstairs. Let me just play up top. Nobody else is and they're probably going to do a vert. I should have reinforced these quicker but it's all good. Gonna try to play my life. They do have the yang, okay. Ooh, if this guy jumps in this window, he's dead. Alright. So 3v5, like I said, gotta make a... Okay, everybody's dead. I gotta go now to help my team. Got 
Got this guy's back. They're gonna push me now for sure. Two v one. Here, drone. This guy's got to get this kill. He can't be dying because he's full health. I'm not. Good angle, Jaeger. Should I move here? I'm gonna play off contact for him. Let me wrap. Let's go, dude. 2v5, baby. Jaeger got three, but I got the other two. I cleaned those guys up in the hall. All right. I don't know if this guy's cheating, but that was a little weird. That guy's recoiled and not even move. It didn't even look like he was controlling it at all. Possibly a Cronus, but who really knows? So I'm not going to accuse. Because I know a lot of people accuse me of that, too. Maybe he's just crazy. Um... That's good. We got two defenses at least, too. That's kind of what we want, but three would have been preferred. Attacking is a little tougher here, but I believe in my team. All it takes is one good teammate in the um, solo queue to really make it easier on you. Like that guy right there, the Jaeger. He didn't just die right away and leave me in a 1v5 because then I probably would have lost. Sorry, I was a little quieter there during that clutch, too. That Ying was just taking 10 years to push. After her team got decimated. I was trying to focus up and not lose that. They're upstairs. By the way, I also swung that hallway the second time because I knew Buck was like 1 HP for my first fight. So I knew I could shred him with the SMG-12. That's my gun. So I got both of them that way. Then Jaeger got another and boom. Just like that, you got a 2v1 instead of a 2v4. I'm going to try to come in off this drone here in the bathroom. Get in down below. Sometimes some people like playing here. They do have a Solus. Don't know who their last is though. Kind of just lurk around on attack here on this map. I don't really know what to do the best. I'm not good at attacking this one. Been getting better recently. Maybe I should have played the Doke, too. I wanted to ask though, so I can help clean more of these windows off, because I know everybody loves jumping out all these. There's three of them. I won't be able to get all of them, but... There's actually four of them. There's the one on, like, the far right where Fink is pushing, to. Cram that up in there. Okay, I'm going to go back to where I started now. Shoot this down for Ghost Pressure. Ghost Pressure is huge in this game. Dude, of course, somebody runs down in here right when I hit it. 3-5, not looking good. Everybody is dead. I gotta take my chance. Yeah, he's just looking at it. Should have just stuck with the team there, but I don't think it would have mattered, probably. Okay, somebody else got the Doka B now, so I can't do that. They're probably going to be downstairs where we just were since we went there second. So they're going to, like, copy it. 
I'm gonna stick on the Ash. I feel good with a gun right now. I mean, I didn't get a gunfight, so... I don't think the operator was the problem. Some rounds are just gonna be like that when you're attacking in solo queue. You have no control of it either, so don't blame yourself. Gotta keep the mental up. I preach this all the time, but it is true, and that's really what keeps me into it. All about the mindset in this game. The solo queue just makes that go up by like tenfold. Can I get a drone on this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't think so. It just pushes me off every time. Let's go on the telephones. Just to check my spawn peak here, since I'm over on this side now. Always check that spawn peak up top. Some people do like running out there and looking right into your spawn. Waiting for this guy to leave first. Might be able to get up shark really fast here. They're below. But if I do go up, I could help with the roam clear a little bit. Oh, hello. Yeah, somebody's up here jackaled. Okay, nice. That's the castle. I was worried he was getting a little closer to me there. There's another guy up top, too. I'm gonna assume that was him. Because our teammate's up here running around, so... Can I get in? 5v3. We do have the numbers here, so we gotta push. Last one's in sight. There we go. Easy as that. That's why I started coming in. I seen 5v3. Started coming down the stairway. Was able to trade that with my. That somehow killed two people. It's okay they didn't trade it. I got the refrag eventually. Then I just took the one at the end there. 2v1. I'd rather me take the one first and our teammate. I didn't want to be left in like a 1v1. I would have pushed in sooner before the first guy died, but there was a Gooba that I did see. That would not have been the play. That was a great attack there. They're probably going to go the other upstairs side, right? I'm going to switch it up a little bit. I think that one's called like Party or whatever. By the way, if you guys uh, didn't know, I think this is our Emerald 4 game, but we've been playing in hidden MMR of like Diamond Champ all season almost. Since like the very first few games I got up there. You start off winning, that's what happens. Winning streaks are huge, by the way. Somebody did confirm in my comments the other day that uh, they said they were on like a 10 game winning streak. And they went from like plus 14 for a win or plus 10 up to like plus 34. And that's a huge increase. That's like over double. So win streaks are truly everything for the hidden MMR system. Even if you think you're stuck later on. Yeah, that's gonna be that doke. Same entry route here. They did go green and red again. Which is the downstairs site. I guess they shot it. They got a solo, so we gotta be wary about that. That's why I'm not breaking this fully right now in case somebody's close. And a cab, alright. Assuming that guy just ran. <laughs> or not, dude. He just came back. He just went to the other side. Like, what is this play? Hey, he can have that kill, I guess. My team's actually doing pretty good here. 4v3. Oh, we got sight. Okay. I was kind of mentioning at the start that they have, like, the Solus, and I seen the Cav. I was going to rotate back to the bathroom window where our team was there, but I picked off, unfortunately. Good stuff, they got us. Easy win. 
Nice, Cav. You're flanking in a 3v1. Good stuff. I wonder if that's the dude that was on, like, ace earlier outside the breach. If it is, that's crazy. Okay, let's chill. I don't know why our teammate was pushing with a revolver right there, but we got the job done. It's uh, all that matters. Good stuff, Twitch. Again, I don't know if these guys are like Zim or Controller or what, but hey. I'll think they're legit until I see uh, evidence otherwise. I'm not gonna accuse. Good game though from an hour back one at least. I'm just glad we won and didn't go to OT. Not a fan of the uh, Outback OT games, like a 4-4. I think that's what it was last time I played this. Let's see. Oh, it wasn't our Emerald 4 game, actually. But we're still getting 50, so not too bad. Next game will be. We'll take that. Before we uh, end this video off, I will do a double header here, because I did get a pretty good warm-up game before I played this one on my Signature 6 account. It was like a full champ lobby as well. Here's the advanced stats though before we swap over to that footage. 30 and 17. Not too bad at all. But yeah, I hope you enjoy the second match here. Let's get that Emerald Plains right out of here. We're playing on the Signature 6 account right now. Oh no, not the canal. Ooh. Big deep breath there. I thought we were about to get some Emerald Plains. We're going to be on attack first here on border. Not too bad for an attack first. I'd say this is one of the more balanced maps for like attack defense. This, coastline, stuff like that. So I'll take that. They didn't ban anybody, which is weird. Since they're on defense. They're probably just all AFK at that point. Yeah, let's ban Fenrir. I like getting a little ratty on borders, so why not? Okay, yeah, they're totally all AFK. They didn't ban a map either, I guess. That's right. These guys are gone. I'm pretty sure I've heard of a couple of them, maybe. The Vixma guy seems a little familiar. I feel like I've seen that name on Twitter or something. If you didn't know already, I do have a Twitter. Follow me on that, at Alumasoka. Same thing as my YouTube, basically. I don't have that many followers on there. I don't tweet too much, but I will sometime. I'll probably be tweeting out when I do streams as well, so have those notifications on. Let's get some Ash gameplay with the R4C. Borders are a good map for Ash. I'll probably go between like Ash and maybe some Doka B. We'll see how it goes. With the ash, first of all. And yes, extended barrel and uh, angle grip is the play here. I've been liking that a lot. I use it in like free-for-alls to warm up. That's why I had to swap it over on this account here. It's crazy. I've been seeing a couple of you guys in my free-for-alls recently. Like, I've been getting recognized in them and then messaged. Just insane to me how people recognize me. Even in a ranked match. Some bonkers stuff. Got a good pre place drop. Got a good pre place drone down here in um, vents. If I end up going below. I'll try to get a mirror for the team first on the main breach if they do have one there. Like on the main armory wall. Usually they do, and Ash is the best counter to mirror. Besides, like, Twitch. Oh my god. I don't think he knows you downed him. That was scary. I was trying to reload my gun and talk. Jeez, man. Rank 2.0 is wild sometimes. <laughs> nice. What is that person doing? I'm gonna claim more of this too, and everybody's dead, so who cares even? 
Okay, they don't have the mirror on that. So just down here too, I'll just try working something up metal at this point. I don't know how everybody died there. People are just way too fast in rank 2.0, man. Surely the sledge kills that. Sledge had a shotgun, by the way. I leaned the wrong way. I was about to lean back to the other side. Because I heard that guy on the left, too. Hey, it's all good. I put an effort there at the end, at least. I don't know why sledge is just, like, sitting here. Like, if he went a metal there with me, he could have got a trade easily. Or if he went first, I would have easily got the trade for him. Oh my goodness. Jesus. That was some interesting mechanics and movement right there. That went very bad, very fast. Are they going to stick to the mirror for this top site? Like for the, uh, not the top site, but you know. For the top hold on vents. Unless they go bathroom tellers, mirror's good there too up top. I don't even know where they had the mirrors. They probably had one on like the small box. Facing like the main breach, and they probably had one in like office. If not both over on that side. I mean, by the time I got up there to even ash... The would be mirror. My whole team is dead. How much you can do there? Gotta move on. Oh man. I was gonna maybe try to work something there, but got my drone shot. Yeah, give me the Doka be here. Somebody's got Ash, anyways. I don't think they have a mirror though, so that's why I'm taking the Doke this time. The go to op for me. I still can't believe that Warren like ran outside that last turn. That was insane. What like what are these people doing, man? That's why I looked up there because I just had a feeling something like that was gonna happen. You can never be too cautious when you watch for spawn peaks and stuff. Another guy just coming outside somewhere. That's a reword. They reinforced up top. Let's see if they're holding it. He's prone. I might be able to get this guy. He went to the corner again, man. They're both up here. I'm just getting out of here. We have numbers right now. Like, there's no need to fight those two. And we have sight. Just playing, guys. Come on. Like, I rotate the other side. This guy's above still. He's just watching the door. Alright. You can have your kill echo, because I think we're going to get the round. Yeah, we got the plant. I figured he would be trying to do something to, like, stop the plant and not just watch that door for some reason, but whatever. That guy tried to hit, like, the WWE wrestling move on those guys. Could have worked if that guy wasn't watching it, but, I mean, you only have two ways back down. Trying to think of what I want to play here. I'm guessing they're going to go back that site. We'll see, though. It didn't go very well for them at all, though. They got destroyed, so they might change it up and go, like, um, bathroom tellers. That's what I was thinking of. 
Mm, sounds like they're here. Yeah. I heard a goo mine, so they have a lesion. Oh, that's a mute. Mm, let me get on Ash. Just because they have a mute, I don't want to have to deal with the mute jammers getting on my drones. I'd probably zap them, but I'm just going to stick on the Ash since it's open again. I'm not going Dokubi this time either. I'm just going to try to go direct, not even worry about up top. My team kind of went crazy just pushing below. Let's see what happens though. Just practicing the recoil because I haven't shot this in a bit. I can destroy this without even breaking the barricade. Complete safety. Yep. I got their cutback. I think they're playing customs pretty hard. Alright. This guy's still playing shotgun on sledge. Mew Jammer. Two of my teammates. Again, my whole team's just dead in a minute. I hope somebody doesn't jump out the balk above me again. We gotta work a pick somehow. That a zombie kinda helps us. I knew I heard that guy. I'm pretty sure I downed that one. If I had the fuse right now, man. Still got plenty of time, even since that was so fast. I heard that guy crawling over to him. Yep. Last one's got to be on diffuser, right? Still got some time to drone him. No! Oh my god. That is so annoying, man. I hit the D-pad to get on the drone, and then I hit a goo mine somehow. Where was that goo mine before? Why did I not hit it until I turned? I lose the round to a goo mine. That would have been a 1v4, man. I really wish I had the diffuser. I win those. I was pretty low in health because obviously I died of the goo mine, so maybe not. Maybe he would have got me anyways, but I at least wanted the shot at it. I wish the zombie didn't hit me so much. I mean, I tried my best there, man. That was like the first round. My team all died like instantly. Like I hadn't even got my claymore set up and they were all dead within a minute again. Gonna try to do some sight set up here with a lesion. I feel like Legion's a really good solo queue pick. You have a shotgun for setting up, you got impacts for like shields, Osa, Nomads, Gridlocks, whatever. Because you can use your shotgun for setting up, you don't have to use the impacts for that. You want to make head holes right here by the way, so it's another angle they have to worry about when they push that door. I'm not going to make the rotate. Because I'm not playing in there. I want to play in office, but... See what the team wants to do. I'm trying to scatter my goo mines everywhere, too. I'll just wait for this one, then I'll go office side. That's the uh, main reason why Legion is so good, too. 
You can get info on everything, man. Kind of works as like more teammates around you. I say that all the time, but you just got to play off your utility when you're on defense in solo queue. Just in general, but especially solo. If they don't drum me here, I'm in like the biggest wrath spot. Dude, that guy just walk in the sight and kill two men. He's dead. Three v three. We gotta reinforce that wall. Oh, okay. Yeah, he just hurt me at the last second. I don't know why he shot me so much after, jeez. That might have been the guy that I spawn or killed off the spawn pick the one round when he was Valkyrie. I don't think he appreciated that. It's gonna be a tough one for the team, 2v3. Is there no meme jammer on like the wall? They might have just shot it. Yep, there's the plant. I don't know what my team's even doing right now. Where is Mute even at? Oh, here he is. <laughs> that is dazed. Good try. Yeah, we kind of lost that round in the opener there when Ram just walked in and killed two. I'm guessing she just threw a Ram drone at the door. We got it back to 3v3 though, to be honest. I shouldn't have peeked that ace, but I mean, I had to do something. I should have went back to site maybe, but then they breached the wall. I don't know. That was just a good play by ace. He heard me at the last second when I got up there. Like if he didn't know, I would have got a free kill on him. I should have jumped out. Also didn't know if there was a claymore though. It's okay, we can come back here, I believe. We still got defense, we just gotta win 2D. I'm gonna play around East Stairs this time, just extend out a little bit more. I feel like that's the play. That's why I took the Vigil too, so it's harder for them to drone me. I feel like I always go off when I take Vigil, so... Let's get this. We have a Cav too, don't know how I feel about that pick. That's the guy that's been playing Sledge Shotgun. I always get the weirdest players on my team, man. And I'm playing a very coordinated stack right now, seems like. Just drone hunting right now. That's a good thing to do when you're solo queue. Get rid of all their information so they can't use it against you. I know there'd be a drone around here somewhere. Usually they put it on the camera. Still trying to warm up, by the way. This is my first game on. That's why I'm on this account. Usually this is like my warm-up account. Huge first pick. I feel like this is a good spot to show. If somebody rats in from like down here. And I still have East Control as well to flank. Probably be three, two. We can just chill now. Nice. A lot better from the team here. I'm going to try to go back to site. 3v1. That happened fast again. Rank 2.0, I guess. Not sure where Ace is pushing here. I want to go back to site, but I don't want to overexpose. Okay. Well, main breach is where he's at, then. Oh, 
Good night. That's the same dude. I knew it. I had to get the get back there. It's all good though. Very scary. My team left me in a 1v1. I don't know how they just die. Well, I do, because Cav was in security or CC still for some reason. I didn't know where the ace was, and then I rotated back too late, but got the job done. I don't know what that breach charge bait attempt was by ace too. That was weird. Somebody always has to take the operator you clutch on. They're like, huh, maybe I can do that if I take Vigil. Let me take some mozzie. I'm going to roam above. See how this goes. Might be the play, because I can cut off a lot of their drone economy this way. That's going to be a free drone right away, probably. Give me that. Just trying to look for any other drones, but not seeing anything. Let's reinforce up here. I'm going to reinforce the main breeze, then I'm going to reinforce the two, like, single walls on the other side I'll show you. If I don't run out of reinforcements, at least. This one here, just to make it easier to play in Armory. And then this one here. Just cutting off the long angle, they have to hard breach it. We didn't get this hatch, so that could be an issue. I'll just try to hold my life though. Fall back if I need to. We'll see how well they drone. That guy got deleted. Two brows on metal, it looks like. I don't know if he's watching the cross, though, so I'll just keep my gun up. There's no way they check this angle. Good night. Good night to their whole team, man. Let's go, guys. Flawless round. We got OT. I told you, anything's possible here. Ooh, huge shot from the tuber. I thought I heard that last guy up here with me still. I just deleted those two guys, especially that lion that tried to push in early. Or Twitch. I think it was lion. Whoever had the 417. Wall bang that guy. Who gave me the wall hacks? Man, if I would have won that one round two that the goo mine clutched up on, then we would have won the game. Very unfortunate. I also swap back to the doke at the last second. I'm gonna try to come in this side this time. Hopefully my team can just survive a little longer. I'm doing this because they didn't have a mirror on the other side, by the way. So I'm going to try to ride around here see if I can catch a roamer off guard. I feel like these guys roam. I do have the mirror again. I mean, when I get upstairs, I'm probably going to have to deal with a mirror eventually. So maybe I should just go ash here. So I feel like the Dokubi is going to be useless once I actually get up. Yeah, I'm going to take the Ash just to be safe. My teammates don't get the mirrors. They could have bond it or ace it, but we'll see. Yeah, I'm just going to try to get in here fast. 
I'm not sure if I heard this guy below or above. Yep. I figured he was below. I'm just watching my team fall apart. Captain's still over here on me somewhere. He just knows. I heard somebody jump down. These guys are about to start running at me since it's 2v5. Jeez, man, there are so many of them. They are really going to town on my body. Pull the pistol out and everything. These guys despise me. It's okay, man. They can kill me in the 2v5. I can't really do much about that. They just traded me with two other people after I killed the one of my Glass. There's no way you lose that, man. You have wall hacks. This guy's just doing tricks on him. He didn't even know he was up there. And he still won the fight. We're back on the defense. We got this. This is where we got our rounds strung together. So I believe in the team still. Yeah, it's kind of like a 2v5 at this point. No excuses though, I gotta play better too. You can always carry harder, that should be how you uh, approach the solo queue. Expect to lose, but try your best to win still. Really all there is to it. You can only control what you do. I'm gonna reinforce over here too this time. We have not been doing that. Let me get off, triple wall if I can. You should always reinforce this, just so it makes it harder for them to get off his control. Last time they just breached it and I was a goner when I was Legion. There's a drone in here somewhere. That points for my observation thing. I heard it too. It could be under any of these things, I don't know. I'll just play an east here again to start. <laughs> Look, he's dead, dude. We got a frost roaming below. Like, what is that dude doing? The rank 2.0 matchmaking is just insane. Like, I'm playing like a champ stack of good players and then... I got that on my team. Nothing against that dude too, it's not his fault. Or her fault. Or their fault. 2v5, man. My timing, right when I move, if I just held that angle, I'd kill this dude. I just had to get aggressive because my whole team is just dead again. Hey, GG to the other team. Those guys are good players. I'm just more confused on what the one dude on my team was doing. That was something else. But I gotta expect that. I'm the one solo queuing. You never know what you can get on your team in this game. I'm telling you some of the things I've seen over the years playing. Still a good game. That was a fun one. That goo mine too, man. That goo mine cost the match. I'm telling you, I would have won that. At least we only lost three on this account since we were right over. I've been getting like 120 or something still on this one. Or close to that, like 110. I think that was my second. Yeah, that was my second loss of the season on this account. My warm-up one. And I've been playing in champs since the first game. My 15 win rate is gone. 
I hope you guys enjoyed that though and found it helpful. If I do make this a video, I probably will. Entertaining. But leave a like down there below. Subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.